Hello guys, um, this is just a quick overview and uh, I suppose a bit of a review as well of the Veho um, scanner. Um, basically you can scan slides and negatives. Now it will only go up to 5 megapixels in terms of its scanning resolution, however for around £100 this isn't a bad uh, scanner. Now it comes in this quite a nice um, tubular container which is quite nice um, and on there um, the specifications um, is basically 5 megapixel high resolution full color scanning one touch instant scan one to two seconds USB 2 uh, powered from USB 2 port so you don't need an additional power um, compact and small footprint Desk space saver, high quality four glass optic elements, fixed focal range and automatic explosion and colour balance. Um, and basically, it's it says it's compatible with XP, Vista, 32 bit, and 64 bit. Now, I have managed to get this to install onto um, my Windows 7 machine, so you can get it installed. However, it can be a little bit tricky to get it actually working. The reason for that is the compatibility issue. What you have to do is before you think about uh, installing the supplied CD, so you get a CD here, this is version 3, but sometimes you'll get version 4, which basically includes your drivers as well as Photo Impression 6, which is a software package that allows you to capture your images. When you're actually doing your capture, you can adjust brightness and colour, so it is quite adjustable if you uh, want to tinker with that. Um, you can do that in, in that software if you want to, however what I would recommend is just go with the basic settings and then import it into Lightroom or Photoshop and do your adjustments in that program. So the product that we have here is called uh, VFS-004 um, and that, that's the, the product. Um, basically all you need to do is when you get your slide, which uh, you basically you get one of these which is a negative holder. So obviously you've got um, six negatives that you can put in there in a row and all you do is you basically slide in there um, you can feel it lock into place for the first one and then all you would do is click the button at the top and it will scan and then onto your next one scan onto your next one and scan and then obviously what you want to do is you want to open this up like so put your negative in the only thing you're going to need to be uh, thinking of is any sort of dust getting onto your negative. So an idea to solve that is have one of these blowers, you can pick them up on Amazon for a couple of pounds and just blow the dust off. You can use a cloth as well but that's probably the best way to go. Um, you also get um, a, a, a soft brush that you can brush your negative with uh, with some sort of velvet uh, or microfiber material on there so you can wipe over your lens uh, sorry the negative or the slide um, incidentally you could use that on, the, on a, a lens if you want to because it's the same sort of material you find on those cloths and then you also get a slide adapter as well so you can pop your slides in there um, you just open it up pop your slide in, close it, then you slide in like you did with negative and you just uh, click the button and the software will record the image for you. Um, and that's all, all it's to it really, you just need to know where you're going to save your file um, and that's it. As I said it's, it's okay, it's not the highest quality out there but um, you can get it installed um, 
if you do experience any problems installing it, what I recommend is uninstall the Photo Impression 6 software um, on Windows 7 that is, or Windows 10 and um, then install the drivers and uh, let the system auto detect the actual scanner because uh, if you try installing the photo impression software first or at the same time as the drivers um, it will register it as a camera for some bizarre reason so keep that in mind but that's the Veho uh, scanner a negative scanner um, a very good product the official name is VFS-004 Deluxe 35mm Film and Slide Scanner um, and it's quite handy and it's powered by USB so you don't need any additional power which means you don't need any cables and you can take that on the road if need be. Um, obviously film is in the past now um, but you know consider it thank you for listening thank you bye bye